Tyler. From the moment I met you, I could tell that life with you would be filled with lots of laughter, adventure, and most importantly, love. Kiss me out of the bearded barley. Aaron, looking back, we were just kids as we began our relationship, and now we're moving on to the next major milestone that I cannot imagine doing with anyone else on this earth. Over the course of the past seven years, I've learned to love the following things about you. You are the perfect gentleman, and I stand here today to attest that what I foresaw as a 15-year-old girl was true, and somehow you've made life even better. For me, it has always been you. laughed together, traveled together, and celebrated together. And here we are today, together. You'll never have to wonder what's going through my mind because it's you and it will always continue to be you. I promise to do my best each day to love you more than I did yesterday. I love you and I'm so grateful the day I get to call you my husband is finally here.
always be the 15-year-old girl I fell in love with, and I'm so incredibly overjoyed that you will now be my wife. You are the missing key to my lock, the last piece of my unsolvable puzzle. You put your arms around me and I'm home. They say love like this comes once in a lifetime. For the first time I believe it to be true. One of the things about Aaron and Tyler and their relationship over the last 7.2136 years is that most of what they do is done together. Not from a lack of independence or because they can't be apart, but because they enjoy each other. Tyler came into Aaron's life, it was never a battle between boyfriend and family. Tyler naturally entered our lives and I'm over the moon, but now he's stuck and can never leave. I was proud that Tyler was proud to have my sister by his side, no matter the circumstances. And that's saying something. Fast forward four years, so much happened in that amount of time. It doesn't take much more than that to understand that this relationship is built on a foundation that is unyielding and indestructible and I'm certain of it. I love you both. I'm happy we're finally here. If everyone can please raise their glasses and join me in toasting and celebrating Mr. and Mrs. Hicks. 